Can you still be a hidden gem after 15 years? Well, you can if you're tucked away in Buckhead, serving an amazing array of South African food. When you walk in this place, you're literally transported to another continent. Let's hang, man, at 10 degrees south. 10 Degrees South is America's very first South African restaurant, founded in 1998. South Africa is known as the Rainbow Nation, and basically our cuisine makes up many different cultures. So you can have anything from mussels in white wine sauce, to steak and potatoes, to curry, and then you can even get as exotic as ostrich. Yeah. Tell me why you like coming to 10 Degrees South. I like the environment, I like the vibe, the music, the food is delicious. Yeah. It's, it's great. Well said. The South African flair to the same foods that you see right. makes it really unusual. So you feel like you're going someplace totally different. Tell me why we did, why are we dig in 10 degrees south. What do you like about it? Um, chicken livers to die for and calamari that's fantastic. The calamari is one of our most popular dishes. It's grilled, not fried. So it's more in the Mediterranean style and people are, you know, they're not used to that. We put the calamari that's been grilled into lemon butter caper sauce and it's served with yellow rice, basmati rice, which has turmeric in it. Very tender, and it's definitely one of our, one of our favorites. There's a lot of restaurants in Atlanta. You can come here and get something that tastes different. A lot of different flavors, a lot of different, different flavors, spices, um, several things on the menu, the, the bobo tea. It's a mix of sweet and spices. Um, there's dates in there. It's a curry dish. Yeah. Fantastic. For whatever reason, ladies love the babuti. They love it. It's a sweet curry dish. This is South African curry. We get it from South Africa. We only use South African herbs and spices. Topped with a savory custard, and it has on the side what we call samples of chutney and chopped onion and tomato. You kind of mix it all in, and it's really good. And it's always good to do something different and, 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 and enjoy something different in town. The sasatis, which are skewers of beef filet topped with an apricot curry sauce. And we serve it with yellow and white. Basmati rice. It can be made with chicken, it can be made with beef, lamb. We choose to make it with filet mignon. And then we serve it with a sasati sauce, which is a, a sweet curry sauce, and it has apricots, dried apricots. And we serve it over the top. Order up. It's not just a restaurant to come and eat great food. It's like a night out. It's a place to go where you know you're going to have a great time. When we come back, I sit down with owner Justin Anthony to find out what's made 10 degrees south such a destination spot for over 13 years. Atlanta Eats is back. With my buddy Justin Anthony. What's Good up, brother? Like. Good to see you. Great to be at 10 degrees south. This is like the ultimate family affair, this place, isn't it? It is, man. It's me and my parents and uh, my wife, and uh, we make it happen, man, for the last 15 years. Why does this place look so cool? Because the food looks awesome, but everything around here, like, who set this place up? I'm very fortunate. My wife's one of the best designers in the country. So uh, we took a little trip to South Africa and uh, came back with uh, some inspiration, and she's responsible. What's the uh, feel that you're looking for? It's a sophisticated game lodge, safari right. game lodge is what we were going for. Right, sophisticated game lodge. Yeah which totally works. Is there a way to kind of categorize what South African food is? Yeah, I mean, South African food is fusion to the max. I mean, you know, people talk about fusion, but this li literally encompasses like so many cultures. You've got Portuguese, French, Dutch, Malaysian, Indian, right. uh, Mediterranean. So anything from uh, steak and potatoes to mussels, ostrich, curry. Yeah, unbelievable combinations right here. Yeah. Fusion to the max, yeah. right? What's going on over here? My little uh, slider action, what's going on right That's here? That's uh, our version of a slider. It's the burravos, which basically translated means farmer's sausage. And it's a great sandwich, beef sausage, lean beef. It's topped with our special sauce, it's fantastic. How about that bread on top? Fantastic. It makes it. Yeah. So what about your dad? I saw him running around. Yeah, my dad and mom are the executive chefs. Right. And they run the kitchen here for the last 15 years. And, uh, you know, that's why it's consistently good. You know, you can't categorize it. You know, you got meats and fishes and big salads. And um, that's kind of what makes this place special, isn't it? It is, man. And, you know, it's, it's very healthy. You know, not, most of our food, I'd say 99% of our food is grilled. We're big into grilling in right. South Africa, what we call a braai. You'd call it barbecue, but we grill out a lot. That's kind of how everyone comes together around the bry. Pretty much, yeah. All right, talk about the wines we're having. You're uh, sipping on a Chenin Blanc, by the way. That's one of the top Chenin Blancs in, in, in the world right now. You did that for me? Of course, bro. That's how we roll. Just because I brought the cameras, <laughs> or you would have done that anyway? Oh, anyway. Really? Yeah. 
All right, buddy. Hey, thanks for having us. 10 degrees south, one of the great places in Atlanta. Cheers, Maine. Thank you. What do you love about coming here? Lots and lots of flavors. Yep. Everything was delicious. The wine was also quite good. They got great wines here, huh? Terrific wine. You know, we're one of the rarities in, in the restaurant world where we have uh, an extensive South African wine list. And there's some phenomenal wines coming out of South Africa right now. We'll talk about the atmosphere a little bit. You like your, uh, oh, what, what, what makes it unique? It's just the whole vibe here. The music, it's just, it, there's a lot. Transports going you on. a little bit? Yeah. I love the music. You love the music? It is my favorite place to go for the music. Definitely. We have great live music, probably some of the best musicians in the city, I would say. The South Africans, we like to have fun, you know, so uh, it's not only about dining and drinking, it's also about having a great time. You know, it's about the experience for us. We want people to come in and really feel like they've been away. I, I think it's great. It's, I've tried to try a different restaurant every week. This is the best one I've been to.